Mm -hmm. So all of us, no matter what we'll face in these upcoming months, mm -hmm. we have to be determined to stay focused. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We can't be moved by the things that we see. And I have a personal testimony about this. About a year ago, a little cat came to our door. And I was taking out the trash one day. And I heard a meow. And I was like, oh, it was a little baby cat. And so I didn't want the cat to starve. It looked a little famished. So I fed the cat. To make a long story short, that cat still, still comes every day. <laughs> <laughs> and a few months ago, that cat gave birth to four kittens. Mm. And we gave one of them away, but we have three of them with us now. And Friday, we let them outside. Mm. And um, I heard, a, I was working, doing some work, and I heard, a, <laughs> and I heard some owls out there hooting. I was like, oh, man, I know owls will attack baby kids. Mm -hmm. And so I came outside, one was missing. Mm -hmm. And I felt bad, because the family had grown so attached, got so attached to these kids. I was like, oh, man, what my parents? It'll be sad. So I brought the news to my parents. I brought them in because it started storming. Thunder and lightning everywhere. I was like, oh, man. I went out there and looked one more time. No sign of the kid. And I told my dad. My dad's heart almost dropped because he, he loves he loves cats. So and I get to see my mom's face. And I was like, we lost one. <laughs> then I heard the, the, the voice of the Lord say, a miracle will happen tomorrow. Mm. I was like, what? I was like, we lost one. We lost it. I believe the things that I saw. I don't want to believe it was a miracle was going to happen. Mm. How come the next morning we found it? Mm. <laughs> Praise God. I said, wow. And God said, will you believe me now? <laughs> Good Lord. I didn't, want to, I didn't want to believe it was the voice of the Lord. I was like, yeah, this is my mind saying, yeah. We can't be moved by the things that we see. Mm -hmm. We can't. We have to stay focused on God and His Word up until the very end, to the very saving of our souls. And by doing that, we advance the battle. Mm -hmm. We tear down all the walls of Satan. We're not only just sitting at home praying and resisting temptation, but we're on the streets. We're talking, we're reaching out to people. We're going to the hospitals. We're doing those things necessary to advance the kingdom of God. And in so doing, we tear down the very kingdom of Satan. Mm -hmm. We progress the battle mm -hmm. beyond just overcoming temptation. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> because the Bible tells us that we humble ourselves to God, we submit to God, we resist the devil, he will flee. Mm -hmm. But we know he's going to come back. Mm -hmm. So that's why we move, we advance the battle. Mm -hmm. By not just saying no to temptation, but we get in the enemy's face. We get in his territory. We surprise the enemy. Mm. But we have to stay focused on God and his words to do that. Mm -hmm. So let us fight. Let us be hungry. Let us advance the battle into the enemy's territory. We've been called to do great and mighty works. Let's take the focus off of us and our lives. We are part of a battle, of a war. A war that we know the outcome. So we might as well take the, the winning side. Mm -hmm. Every time we neglect to pray, we neglect to fast, we neglect to study, we side up with the losing team. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because that's an action of unbelief. When God has told us to love him with the all. Mm -hmm. So if we know we still have areas in us that oppose God, why are we still relaxing? Why are we comfortable? But we should be taking the battle to the enemy. Mm -hmm. Amen. 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 Father, Amen. we just thank you for this time. Thank we thank you, you for your word. Thank, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Which has ultimately given us the victory mm -hmm. to overcome Satan <coughs> and his kingdom. Help us to abide by that truth in your word, Father. Help us to fight, to contend for the faith. Help us to be hungry and passionate for you like never before. Yes. For we know that you are all and in all. And we thank you, Father, that you be with us, leading God up to the very end. Until we hear the words said, well done. Thank you. Thou good and faithful servant. Forgive us for the past. But we start a new day today. Right now, it's a new moment for us to pursue truth and your righteousness. That we are not afraid of anything.
that will happen to us on this earth. Mm -hmm. But we know, we believe in the power of the resurrection. Thank you. And we believe in perfect love, which casts out all fear. Yes. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.